Well, we're going to continue generating other features to our character. This face here still looks too flat. And there are still some shapes we have to adjust as well. We go a subdivision down to start adding volume. This will give us an idea of how this shape should look. Okay, so we'll draw some guidelines here to give an idea of how it should look. We'll add some volume here. Maybe move it. The characters started to look a little thin as soon as we added volume there. But this is going to be easily fixed by adding more volume in this area. We feel slightly here too, so this cleft doesn't look so deep. We adjust the shape with the move brush. It's starting to look a little pump cheek, not what we're looking for. His face should look thick. Aggressive, not just fat. The chin is looking too big, or stretched, so we have to fix that right away. Now with the move brush, let's deepen this area a little bit. Here outwards and here inwards. Less curved.
Once we make these adjustments, the face should look more angular. We can continue making some extra wrinkles. Or maybe we can move this area backwards. We need to give more space to this fold here. A subdivision up. Well, we see that the character is taking good shape. Okay, let's continue with the wrinkles. These ones start from the outer or lateral commissure of the eye. Starting from here. In fact, this was half marked already. The wrinkles don't necessarily mean that the character is old. We start to bring out the folds. Well, our character looks more angry. There's still some faults left to add. Some here. Now the character is looking much more angry. Let's finish this area. We disable the symmetry and polish a little bit more this wrinkle.
now with the symmetry and we add some more volume here We select the damn standard brush to finish. Let's make this fold. Well, I hope you're liking the result, but this character needs more polishing. In the next video, we'll be working on the lips. These lips look too basic but we are going to polish them. See you in the next video.